Well, look who's back. You think I'm supposed to be impressed that you killed a G3 officer? Y well, okay, yeah, fine. I am. I think it's pretty insane you didn't die. That's all you're getting out of me. Now, turn that bounty in. You got yourself another talking gun? And this one's green? Wow, who cares? No one. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine. Be rude. My name is Gus, not that it matters to you. Here we go. Look at you. You're getting the hang of this bounty hunter thing already. How'd the mission go? They killed a G3. Looks like I taught them well. Wow, really? Whoa, okay. Well, I'm impressed. <laughs> I was, I was always hoping you'd find your calling. I just I didn't think it would be bounty hunting. But then again, I don't know what I thought it would be. Maybe hairstyling and not good at it. And what's wrong with bounty hunting? Ugh, can you please tell this dried up sack of shit to go home? I don't want to share a couch with him. Tough titties, Leslie. You're kidding me, had a deal. It's Lizzie! And that's not my kid, Jesus, we're siblings. Sorry, I don't know how your species works yet. Sibling, fine, got it. Doesn't change a thing. I live here now. Come on, can't he find his own place to stay? Hey, that's not right. I'm barely taking up any space. You know we had a deal fair and square. Oh, come on, we barely know this guy. You're really gonna side with him over your own sister? Hey, you should be proud. You raised your child to have proper respect for a good, fair business deal. Oh, now I know you're doing this on purpose. I'm the sister, not the mom. But you knew that, didn't you? Sorry. My bad. You come waltzing back in here stinking like dirty Flimborg, of course I'm gonna get distracted. You shouldn't be hanging out with that Flimborg boy, you know? Can't trust that species. Tweak's harmless. And nice. You're being spacist. And he's not my boyfriend. Yet. Trust me. Flimborgs are bad news. Come on, have my back here. Okay, yeah, you got me there. Thank you. God, I just don't think I can take much more of this guy. What, you think this is easy for me? If I'm pissing you off, at least you can leave. But my legs don't work. I'm stuck listening to your boy trouble every time I'm trying to watch my stories. I can't even get peace and quiet in my own home because there's an alien cripple jerking off on my couch 24-7. Hey, c come on. That's a high estimate. Ew, I was kidding. Yeah, me too. I was kidding. We all know I was kidding. Aren't you going to say anything? Whose side are you on anyway? Oh, that's just great. Tossing your own sister to the curb. You know I'm the only other human you've got left right now, right? Hey, kid, I'm flattered. Really, I am, but uh, I'm not gonna be your new sister or anything. That wasn't part of the deal. Ugh. All right, that's enough excitement for one day. You got more bounties to get to, kid. And you might want to check out the pawn shop to see what you can spend your new payout on, eh? <sighs> Oof, that was tense. It's times like these I'm, I'm almost relieved I don't have any family. <laughs> But, but not really. I miss him a lot. Hey, uh, just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever and grind for money, look for loot you miss, whatever. Uh, Up to you. Just thought I'd tell you. Good luck out there. Here. I'm gonna go explore Blim while you're out there bounty hunting. Hey. Be careful out there. Humans are a valuable commodity. Someone might try to snatch you up. I can take care of myself, Gene. Oh my god, is that weasel? You the owner of this house? It can't be here. Gotta give you a ticket. I hate to do it. I hate to give you a ticket. But it's my whole job. It's the one thing I do. Look, you can leave your house here if you really want to. But you're just gonna get more tickets. <laughs> Thanks for that much needed touch. 
for touching me. And what brings such an esteemed bounty hunter to my humble establishment? with wonder. Thanks for your business. Don't buy anything else. Took you long enough. The concrete I poured's dry now. and we all shoot guns at bad guys. I'm Jeffrey Gunshooter. I'm Jerry, also Gunshooter. And I'm Bob Gunshooter. Smith. Jerry, Bob, and Je Jeffrey Gunshooter, one of them with the uh, hyphen it Smith at the end. And we're all here to just shoot our guns. There's a goddamn sandstorm going on, bunch of fucking sand in my eyes. No, you're you got a helmet on. No, I don't I don't. Shit, you know, you can't relate to this. Why don't I have a helmet? You're getting me the helmet upgrade the second we're done with this shit. Oh shit, Greebles. Look, look at them go. They eat up broken ship parts. Does it taste good? I no idea. I'm not I'm not about to give it a taste test. Oh yeah, no, you, you can kill these guys. Nobody cares. They're just like, you know, guys to shoot. Felt good to get that out of me. Are you sure you can navigate through this? I, I, I can't even tell which direction we're going anymore. You make a great team, you know? Off. Yeah, a wreck like this is pretty normal on Port Turin. You know, this asteroid's always been a lawless land, but now that the G3 set up shop, it's even worse. I heard scavengers used to suck in freighters with a big magnet and loot their cargo. You know, I mean, this place is fucked, you know, Port Turin. Here we are. Oh, 
I think that's Old Town in the distance. You know, that was the first settlement out here, pre-G3. We gotta pass through there to get to Douglas. Hey! Gotcha, bitch! Hey, you know, I, I'm sure this goes without saying, but the, you know, that green stuff is toxic and will da will hurt you. So don't go in it, into it. to our advantage. No, I, I, I think we should do Taco Bell for tonight. Unlock the fucking Grim Reaper! sick of the desert. Can we just move on to the next bit, you know, please? This is uh, pretty lame, so let, let, let's let's get to the good stuff. All right. I don't care. I just want to stab it. See Old Town, it's just across this bridge. And, uh, you know, I'll tell you what, support themes have this. I'm gonna check in here. I'm gonna say, fuck you with the support beams, fuck you with the stairs, you're both a couple of keyblowers, and you know what, fuck you. Oh my god, you gotta call me a keyblower again, you son of a bitch, son of a bitch. I can't, whoa, 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 hey, whoa, tough whoa, guy, whoa. hey, 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 look, walk away, hey, 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 this is Fucking Mac and Cheese us. Brothers construction site. We ain't done here. But you gotta be careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Hey, calm down. What the hell? How do you want to handle this? Maybe we just, you know, move past Are you them. kidding me? You think you could just walk up into a Mac and Cheese Brothers construction site like you're some sort of fucking Jesus Christ and just fucking walk around like you own the place? There's a goddamn bottomless pit over here, asshole. You think you could survive that? Falling through a fucking bottomless pit down to the bottom? I don't think so. We got work to do. Okay, dipshit? Get the fuck out of here, asshole. You know? Hey, fuck you. You piece of shit. You walk in here, you're pissing me off. Me and my Mac and Cheese Brothers were pissed. You know, we're getting fucking angry. We, 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 we're hot-headed over here. We don't like this shit. We don't like when somebody walks in and stomps all over our fucking uh, garden, so to speak, metaphorically. This is our fucking garden, and you're walking all over the fucking plants we just, uh, the seeds we just planted, you son of a bitch. You know, we're busy whoa, whoa, over whoa. here. Hey, what the frig? Hey, 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 easy, easy, easy. Hey, what the hell you doing? You fucking piece of shit. Hey, 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 hey. What's your big deal? Oh, oh, you just oh, killed my fucking race. Right. Whoa, 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 well, great. You killed all the weird construction guys. You know, we're free to move along now like we were before we killed them. Hey, sorry, us Mac and Cheese Brothers, you know, we can be a little hot-headed. You know, it's fine if you kill any of them, you know? We're all really loud and annoying, so I get it. You know, our family has a lot of brothers, so, yeah, it, you know, it's no real big loss. It's fine. 
Okay, see you later then. Oh, jeez, all right, bye. Come oh, on, crossing my antenna for something good here. Call Kimmy. Okay, yeah. I'm, 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 I can help with this. Oh my god, you messed that up. Come on, you just gotta bounce it off the wall. Hey, nice work. You know, it wasn't a hard thing, but nice work. Move through this place and we'll, we'll get to Douglas. Hey, you whippersnappers looking to get into Old Town? Hey, we should talk to this guy. I calls him like I sees him. He, he seems helpful. Howdy there, partner. Welcome to Old Town. They call me Old Wet Grundy. How can I help you? So, uh, well, you know, tell us. What, what, what is this place? Well, I just told you it's called Old Town. Back when settlers first landed on this asteroid, we formed a little trading post free from galactic law, where anyone could come and do as they please. Nowadays, Dragstown steals all the thunder, but for a few years there, Old Town was nothing to sneeze at. All right, so Old Town is the old town, and Dragstown is the, the, the new one? Old Town has heart. Used to serve a real purpose for the people. Drag Town is just a pit of debauchery and drugs. The Concern G3 Cartel. Hey, do you happen to know where we can find a, a, a guy named Douglas? Douglas? The, 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 the G3 fella? <laughs> oh, wee. He's a rough one. Never seen somebody drink as much as him. Why, just last night. Uh, nobody. I shouldn't speak out of turn. The G3 don't like that none, and I don't like them. Just head down to Dragtown. I'm sure you'll find them. And how do we get to Dragtown? It's, it's, it's been a little bit for me. Oh, that's easy. You just go through this gate, pop into Old Town, and shoot straight down the main strip. You can't miss the big Dragtown entrance. It's a real goddamn eyesore. Wish they'd get rid of it. I'll open the gate for you. Oh, well, thanks, Grundy. That's all wet Grundy. And of course, opening the gate's my whole job. It's why I'm here. I'm happy to do it for some charming young women's like you. Have a good time in there, young man. That party last night was crazy. Did you see how wasted Douglas got? Hell yeah. Joining the G3 was the best idea we've ever had. I've never felt so alive. Me too. I'm all fired up. I just... Let's go. Never should have joined up with the bad guys. 
I know what the app is. my postmaster bullet. Another. Oh, there's. Yeah, f kill him. You don't belong here, so get a move on. This is just like a real old one. You know, pretty cool, huh? It's cool. It's, uh, uh, what do they call it? It's, it's uh, diverse. We've got a diverse palette of things going on here in this game, you know? We got an old way shootout. Who would have fucking thought, you fucking bitch? You fucking stupid bitch? I'm sorry. I, you know, listen, I, this is an old way shootout. It's cool. You don't belong here, so get a move on. You don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. Got him open for ya. Hell, yeah, we don't get none too many visitors here in Old Town. You sure you ain't looking for Drake Town? Hey, I can't let anyone in right now. There's too many recruits causing trouble in town. I get in trouble when that happens, so I'm gonna keep the gate locked until they stop or get killed. Wink, wink. Oh, okay. I see what's happening here. You want us to kill them. Whoa, I didn't say that. I just said wink, wink, and okay, yeah, that's what I meant. So go kill them and, and I'll let you through. You hate to see it. Look at this. Some G3 trouble going down. They just can't help themselves, can they? Yeah, we're allowed to harass people. You know what time it is, bounty hunter? Let's light their asses up. I'm willing to bet that's not the last of them. Thank you so much for saving me. Oh my god, thank you. Uh, but you know what? I kinda... I'm kinda thinking I would've fucked him. So now I... 
I don't know. I'm gonna go think about that. See you later. Drunk recruits. Have you learned anything? Hey, Honcho, let's clean this town up. Shit, they just keep coming. Holy shit, brutal. <laughs> What's up? You know, th thanks to us, you know, quite a team we are. Anyways, uh, l l l l let's, uh, let's poke our way into Dregtown now. Let's go to Dregtown. So I don't know how many times I've told the recruits not to cause trouble out there or if someone's gonna kill them. You told us to kill them. Tomatoes, potatoes. I'm just a dumb gate guard. Whatever, head on through. Hey, have, have fun in Dregtown. Be careful, a lot of G3 guys down there and they're a bit trigger happy. The G3 really spruced up Dregtown. You can get anything you want out. Oh, you know I was talking, right? Are you looking for glory? Then join the G3 cartel. My name's Douglas, the G3 chief of training and torture. Ignore that second bit for this ad. This was just about the training. Well, goddamn, that, there, there's Douglas right there. Uh, that's how you know we're in the right spot.
Okay, Douglas again. This ad is about the torture. Uh, the last one was about joining the G3, but this one is about how I love torturing. It's not an ad for anything. It's just like a reminder that part of my job is also torturing people. Enemies of the G3, random strangers who looked at me funny. Dylan is part of the Mothers Against Violence Treaty, so no violence allowed here. Mothers Against Violence. I got a system well, here. I sell yeah, stuff you in buy our it. favor, huh? We don't, we're not gonna have to worry about any trouble in this area. Look, I'm a murderer. I'm very open about that. Just keep that. Ah, you're so lucky. Now I don't have to kill you. All right, now Stram. We don't have anything against anyone who loves violence. Wow, so this is what a G3 run city looks like. Anyway, yeah, I'm excited to join the G3, but I'm gonna miss my wife and six kids. Oh yeah, I had mine killed before I left so I wouldn't feel bad. Wow, that's so smart. I'll do that too. I'm gonna kill my wife and kids so I don't miss them. So like I was saying, my brother told me Douglas is really into torture. Like sexually? Does it matter? Yes, to me it needs to be sexual. Why are you telling me this? I barely know you. Oh, my bad. Yeah, just sort of spilled out. Well, now you know. Do with it what you will. I'm not doing anything with it. Oh, I hope we don't have to meet Douglas. Yeah, jeez, that guy scares the shit out of me. He was trying to play Gary alive at the party last night. He should have. Honestly, Gary's a racist. Oh yeah, Gary needs to be flayed alive for sure. Just, you know, there's a time and a place. Maybe we shouldn't be talking about this stuff out loud. anything against anyone who loves violence, but it's just not our Get your grubby mitt off of me. Also, all our children are in their 30s. You were all at the party last night, right? Douglas was fucked really up. Oh yeah, that guy, guy was pounding the back like a full-grown scrubulon, which are like the Irish of space, in case you didn't know. But you do know, we all know space stuff. Yeah, goddamn, I don't want to stereotype, but I bet 50 pesos Douglas has some scrubulous blood. You know what, I'm gonna go look into that. violence allowed here. Take care. Damn, can you believe they built all this on the bottom of an asteroid? I mean, I, I, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's a good place to hide out, I mean, but yeah. Hello there, my child. I'm from a sweet little organization called Mothers for Violence, and you're about to enter a sector for the Whoa, look at that, look at that. They got, they're, they're fucking dealing with some greebles over there, dumb fucks. Okay, shit, I, I guess let's just kill them all. Hi. You ready, bounty hunter?
That was violent. G3 training facility. Maybe Douglas does the training in person. Okay, listen. Let's this try to get inside. The torture. Uh, the last one was about joining. One is about how I love torturing. It's not an ad for anything. Torturing people. Enemies of the G3. Random strangers who look anybody. Anybody. I'll torture whoever. Doesn't matter to me. I just love doing it. Okay. That's it for this one. That's a wrap. Hey there, freaks and geeks. Check it out. It's the G3 cartel. Hey, hey, you can trust me. He's fine. I'm trustworthy, I promise. Hey, hey there. Thanks for coming over here. I'm the goop guy around these parts. You wanna sneak in the G3 facilities? You gotta get covered in goop. That's just how it goes. My stuff's quality. So yeah, yeah, you want some goop, right? Uh, you know what? Yes. How about how about a big fat yes? Let's go. Perfect. Head down the alley there and just uh let the magic happen. I guess. Uh, d don't don't worry. First goop's on me. Just tell all your buddies about it. I'm the goop guy. I do goop stuff. Oof! Oh my god! Oh gee! Oh my god! Not not what I was thinking it would be. Oh! Oh! This fucking! Oh my god! The smell! Oh my god! I'm gonna fucking throw up. Okay, okay, I'm alright. Hey, look at you! You're all gooped up. I gotta be honest. It won't last long. It's not the real stuff. So you better be quick. Get in. Get out. Don't stay in there too long. Don't lollygag. Cause this stuff's gonna fall off. That's the goop guy promise. That's the guarantee. You're 18, right? By the way. Okay. Thank you. Oh, looky here. We got another gooped up G3 recruit. Be advised that the G3 cartel is not responsible for any life-threatening injuries you may incur on these premises. But even if we were, we wouldn't give a shit. Who cares? Are you fucking kidding me? They have some whole thing prepared? Shut the fuck up, it's starting! Welcome, welcome, welcome! I'm sure you already know who I am, but for anyone living under a rock, I'm Douglas, G3 Chief of Training and Torture. And wouldn't you know it, I like to blur those lines a little. Training? Torture? What's the difference, I say? I look to your left, difference. now look to your right. Both of those people are gonna die today. You are about to jump right into an accurate warp-based simulation of what it'll look like to be on the real battlefield. And let me tell you, you're probably gonna die. But hey, if you don't, you get to join the G3. Big whoop. All right, that's it. Lock and load, fuckers. Oh my God, is that? All right, shut you it saw off. that, right? I got Th that was a galleon. To Douglas has a galleon. We, we, we got a rescuer. Jesus, these fucking Merkeloids. Well, fuck, here we go. I, I, shit, I hope it's not too difficult. Die, you creepy crawly bastard. Where are you? Kidding me more? Hey! Grenade! Right? Oh, okay, you beat all the weak guys. Easy! 
Really easy. Now go do the obstacle course. Oh, okay. Mom, I know we're not doing this just for fun, but it is, it's fun. It is. And you killed You a meatable head. I'm doing it. Okay, you know what? It looks like some simple platforming, you know, like what you'd see in like Lucky's Tale on, uh, you know, or um, you know that one uh, that one game that we that we all know and love, Mario Land or whatever. You know, uh, listen, uh, you're not gonna impress me if you if you if you get through this. Cause it's pretty simple. Oh god, uh, <laughs> I have a pacemaker. One zap would kill me. Okay, l let's just get this over with, please. Really? You got hurt? Yeah, that, l that looked like it should have been easy. Stop messing up! Whew, okay, get that fucking jump. God damn! That was a little that, that we we made it. That was a little tough though. Congratulations, shitheads! So you made it past the first training exercise. Big deal. That one was easy. We lied and said it was hard to scare you. Oh, it's fun to freak you out to fuck with your heads. Now get ready for exercise two. It starts in one hour. That's right. You have to wait a full hour. We're testing your resolve. So just stand there patiently and wait. Then this door will open and you can continue. Uh, okay, there's no way we're waiting a full hour. Okay, thank God. Okay, let, let's ditch this whole recruiting bullshit thing. There goes that bootleg goop. Uh, I guess that didn't last for very long. Oh my god, hello! Thank god you're here. My name's Dr. Jupy. Douglas kidnapped my whole family, and I'm trying to sneak in and save them. But I just can't get through these pipes in the next room. Oh my god, I'm freaking out! Hey, whoa, whoa, l l listen, little guy. We're trying to find Douglas, too. You know, maybe we can help each other. God, I'm so worried I'm gonna, gonna throw up. You really helped me? Oh, gee, I'm, I'm so grateful. Follow me. You gotta connect these pipes for me so I can get through and save my family. Hey, don't worry. This is a classic textbook puzzle situation. I think me and my bounty hunter partner can figure this one out. Don't even worry. Oh, how wondrous. I'm forever in your debt. I don't know how I can ever repay you. God, my poor family, my wife, Plimmy, my kids, Swoopy and Froopy. <gasps> I'm gonna get to see them soon. I, I should be able to spin those pipes around by shooting them. Any old shot would work. You're really gonna do it. I bet you're gonna solve this puzzle in no time. Wow, you did it. You got the door. Open. Listen, I'll never forget this. You're my personal hero. Oh, come on. You're too you're too kind. It, it was easy. Oh, did you say you're heading to find Douglas too? His office is that big building up on top of Dregtown. Uh, there's a zip line just past here that'll take you right to him. Huh. Well, all right then. I I, I hope the guy gets his family back.
This is basically done. We finished this shit. We are fully out <sighs> Okay. What is this? Congratulations to all of you worms who made it this far in your training. It is now time for the final test. A bloody free-for-all. Last one standing gets to join the G3. No rules, just killing. Good luck, shit heels. God damn it, another fucking thing with this. Holy shit, just kill them all. Congratulations, recruit. Now, uh, I don't know, fight some more guys.
wanted to be. Woo! We could be if we wanted to. Congratulations, graduates on joining the G3 or whatever. I really can't stress enough how little I give a shit. Now report to your commanding officer and we'll send you off to die fighting for us on whatever dumbass planet we decide. See ya. Glad to see you. I'm so happy we keep running into each other. Oh, look who it's our old buddy. It's our old friend, Dr. Jupy. What are you talking about? How, wh how's it going? Uh, there's another locked door. I'm running out of time. God, I'm so worried about my kids. And a little bit about my wife, but mostly my kids. Okay, well, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Oh, my poor kids. I hope Douglas doesn't kill them. I can feel my wife Plenty calling for me. Solve this one too. Thank you. Oh, Plimmy and the kids are probably so scared without me. I hope Douglas isn't torturing them right now. Swoopy and Poopy would really like you two. Oh, they're good kids. I can't wait to introduce them to you and tell them about everything you did for me. They need good, strong role models. <laughs> amazing! Amazing! You did it again! Douglas's office isn't too far from here. I'm going on ahead. I'll see you there! Jesus Christ, Douglas is gonna kill Dr. Jupy. Look at look how weak and, and cute Dr. Jupy is. Forget about it. This is an urgent announcement. This sector has temporarily been designated as a mother's four and against violence zone. That means it's probably just going to be a lot of violence. An intruder has infiltrated the Chief 3 recruitment program, and there will be lots of violence here until we find and kill them. And remember, hey, it's the asshole who's been fucking with our training exercises. Oh, shit, here we go.
That's what they get for joining the G3. You know, I, I, I guess. I don't. I don't know. It's. I, I, I'm. I, I'm. I'm conflicted on it. It's rough. This is it. Douglas is right beyond this door. Can you help me out one last time? Yeah, let's do this. Oh, huzzah. Plimmy, Froopy, Sloopy, here I come. Here we go. Oh, you're so good at these. I wish I was as good at these as you. You're really good. Did you go to puzzle school? Yes! You're halfway there! Keep going, you can do it! Oh, I can't wait to see my little flimmy, floppy, and droopy! I've decided that if my family is dead, I'm going to kill myself and join them in the afterlife. Don't walk me out of it! This is what love does to a person! Don't feel bad if it takes you a while. It's tough, right? You're a good team! <laughs> you go for it, idiots! Thank God! Do you know how hard it is to solve a fucking puzzle with a hangover? Well, shit! D does that mean he's... Huh? I, I feel pretty stupid right about now. He was fucking with us! We got played! Look at us! We got played! We fell for it! Damn it! <laughs> oh, fuck off! <laughs> I was never Dr. Jupy! There is no Dr. Jupy! Are you shocked, you idiot? You fucking moron! Of course you are! Ha 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 ha! you never once suspected your helpless little friend, Dr. Jupy, was actually hiding his true identity! Ha! There never was any Flimmy or Jeffy or whatever those made up stupid bosses. Let's see how you deal with my trained recruits who are also my torture victims! Thanks again for all the help. I got wasted at the party and woke up in a ditch without my exosuit. I was helpless and vulnerable. You could have killed me so easily, but instead you held me back into it. <laughs> Idiots!
Some very nice, choppable flesh, actually. It was actually very nice. Oh, fuck! All right, dipshit, let's go. What? No hello, nice to meet you, or thank you for saving me? Why? Like, you not dying there with some sort of favor to me? Hi, I'm Sweetie. Thanks so much for rescuing me. How is that, dipshit? Now, come on, use my time bubble to escape through the big fan in the corner. Cool, right? You're gonna find out real fast that I'm the best Gatlian. Smartest, most useful, best looking. No, no, come on, come on, I'm pretty good. Douglas, it's Garmentuous. Where the fuck are you? I heard you made a complete fool of yourself at that party last night. Not good, Douglas. Not good. I'm gonna need you on top of your game now that we've got a hold of these humans. We're spread thin over on Earth. And I need more troops immediately! Not to mention things are gonna start heating up all over the galaxy as demand goes up. Big things are happening, Douglas! Get excited! And get your fucking shit together! Okay, yeah, fuck that! You wanna fuck these guys up? See what else this time bubble can do? Oh, 
great. Perfect. Now hurry and cross before it wears off. Incredible, right? What a thrill. You know, you can use that time bubble on the G3, too. And try loading the bubble up with my crystals. Then you'll see why I'm the best Gatling. We're gonna make it. Just listen to everything I say. So what's next? You turn in the bounty somewhere? Go do that. We can wrap this up. Kid, another one down, huh? Great work. <laughs> but uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. All right, good. Get over here. Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizen. That's Clug Nugman. Blim City Magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit, we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 car. All right, all right. Now catch this next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! Incredibly, they've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. Yeesh, desperate much? Can he even help us? I already told him you go. Oh, great. No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Just head through there. Clug's expecting you. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. It wasn't really our idea, but hey. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Uh, no. We're Gatlians. Unless you're talking about my personal chauffeur. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? Yeah, I'm sure the big hotshot politician wants blood on his hands. That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you... You've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Oh yeah? And how's that? This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. What's the catch? Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit like we're gonna stop now. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. 
I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. Yo! So, <laughs> it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yep, and he even gave us this weird thing we could save humans with. God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Broto's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. Oh, God, is that a weasel?